Hello, uh, this is the Saturday Wrap um, for Saturday the 10th of October 2020. I should be going into hibernation anytime now because that's probably the best thing to do. I'm not altogether sure whether I dropped in a word or a phrase of the week last week. If not, here's a doubler. Autumn. Or, if you're in the States, the fall. I think I may have used that before, but it's definitely autumn now. I think there was a bit of frost overnight. There's a bit of whiteness in the back garden. You know, um, and there's been lots of rain. Um, and there's been lots of heavy dew, and it's been cold, and although the sun's still warm, unless you're out of the wind, you won't feel it. And there you go. So anyway, if you haven't seen this before, this is a look back on week ending Saturday the 10th of October. And it's what happened in my life. Although it tends to verge on the sarcastic, um, the tech based and um, ale based. So let us start off with a beer. I can't see the camera, so I hope you can see this. This is a gangly ghoul. It's by Green King, who have usually a bad rap because they are a mainstream brewer and they brew for the mainstream. Although this is not bad. 4.2% alcohol by volume. Of course, it's for Halloween. It's a little bit toffee. Uh, they say it's orange citrusy. I can just get citrusy um, and spicy. I have, of course, in a quality glass. It's smooth drinking. A little bit tingly on the tongue. I'm giving it B plus and a bit. And it was given to me, which was really nice. There's also another bottle of it, which I will probably have sometime over the weekend. Also got some cake. Um, and that was for just doing my job. Actually, not my job, but I'm about the only one in there who could do that job. Yeah, that's 2020 for you. Anyway, so autumn it is. And I'm sure we will soon be into winter. Anyway, when you left me last week, yeah, my Windows laptop, this is being done on my MacBook Pro. Well, I'd updated to Windows 10 2004. And the desktop was fine. And then about a week later, last Saturday, there was an update from Lenovo and bye bye desktop. So, okay, you can get round it quite easily. Um, it's just like a black screen when you log on. Control, Shift and Escape brings up Task Manager, Alt and F, and then Run New Task, Explorer, and off it goes. But it was just annoying, and it was doing other odd things as well, which I don't like. So, I have just reset the whole thing. And it's on 20.04. And the desktop is back. However, uh, um, all the apps are gone. I have to reinstall everything. And although I do have a full system backup, that will put the old version of 20.04 on it. And no thank you. I'm looking at it at the moment. The desktop is rather empty. Um. Although I've got Chromium Edge on there, which has synced, which has saved me a lot of time. And I'm beginning to think that an enhanced version of a Chromebook might be the way forward. If only a Chromebook could do really nice video editing. Anyway, I don't know if I'll keep the desktop. It's not supposed to go away in the first place and Lenovo support were unsupportive. Right. Okay, so last Sunday, moving on and moving off the subject, I had a feeling that uh, the lockdown might be removed on Thursday. So I probably about halfway packed. <laughs> um, 
Okay, long story short. Um, when the lockdown first came in, it was on a Thursday. Yeah, um, and last week, uh, the announcement for the extension was at about half past one. So I worked on the principal. Okay, half past one, I could book a room. I'd already arranged leave and cover. And it took them to about half five and we're still locked down. In fact, the figures are up. In fact, they don't even tell you what figures we need to be at to remove the lockdown. I think most people, um, most people in work anyway, say lockdowns are not working and um, we're going to have to live with this. Um, so just get on with it. I'm kind of thinking that way anyway. So I'm still packed. I'm hoping for this week. I don't think it's going to happen, but who knows? Anyway, I mentioned about the cake. Cake had coconut in it. It was very subtle and very nice. And there's still a bit left, so Monday in the office, cake Monday. As with a day and something, Tuesday turned into Tritium Tuesday. I have little Tritium markers on um, my rucksacks. And I noticed on my new Monroe 35 that it wasn't a marker. It was still on my old one. So I moved it over and it wasn't very bright. In fact, it wasn't at all. And I looked on the bottom and it looked like the tritium file had fallen out of it completely and gone missing. So, a new tritium marker. Not enough to read by. Um, but in the pitch black, which we are now in, um, it is a very good marker. And I like them. Thank you, eBay. And on Wednesday, Eddie Van Halen died. I remember the first Van Halen album. I still love the first Van Halen album. And Van Halen too. What a hero. What an excellent guitar player. He changed guitar playing. Much like Jimi Hendrix did. Things were completely different after him. Ah... <sighs> What a cracking album cover as well. And Ted Templeman production. So, with the cold weather, out oh, came a new do uh, duvet. Uh, 4.5 to 10.5, it's the new one I got earlier on in the year because I tipped uh, shoe cleaner, um, liquid, um, what do you call the stuff? Uh, polish. Liquid polish all over the end of my bed. <laughs> oh whatever anyway so I have mentioned that I have reset the thing and it is working so I'm going to be spending the rest of the day getting on with reinstalling practically everything oh I have great fun and if I wasn't and if it was a year ago there would be Oktoberfest there would be the Weatherspoons Autumn Beer Festival which Time Hop Abe Show me lots of photographs of and I'd be in Bristol in the commercial rooms where they have all the beers on but I'm not um I suppose that's the thing uh, anyway um coming up soon I think it's the week after next Beano's planned will I still be locked down this Tuesday starts Prime Day and also uh, Apple, the iPhone announcements. It's going to be interesting. I'm going to be drinking more beer. Anyway, I think that's it. Bye-bye. And where are you, Lodgy? There you go.